Now it comes time to store the meter. Um, there, there have been many times I've seen uh, individuals take the test lead and just simply wrap the test leads around the meter and then put it in a drawer, throw it in a gang box. Uh, this is not the proper way to store a meter. Uh, please take care of your meter. Treat it right. First thing I do, uh, this is maybe a personal thing, but I think it's the proper thing to do is I go ahead and remove the test leads and I will find the case or the pouch that I use to help protect it from the weather and the surroundings. And I'll go ahead and set my meter. I double check to make sure that the meter is in the off position. I will take and store the meter inside the pouch. Then being as careful as I possibly can, I'll take and wrap or bend the test leads, making sure there's no stress on these fittings right here. And then I will simply take these test leads and store them with the meter inside the pouch. They can certainly be stored separately from the pouch if, if you have the, uh, the occasion to do so. Then I will take that properly stored meter and I will set it aside in a nice cool dry place uh, with my electrical gloves. That way I know if I need to grab them, which I typically do together, they're in a nice cool dry place together and uh, they're out of ways harm. I can grab them, don them, uh, my gloves and my, my face shield or whatever it may be, and there I have my meter right with me. 